King George. What? 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 King George. What? I I need rent money, and you have a, you've lived here for two months without giving me any of your so-called chachingies. So I'm gonna need those, or you're gonna have to get out. Oh uh, well, we got a little problem there. Aren't you like the king of Hawaii or something? Don't you have a lot of money? <sighs> king of fluffle butteria. Fluffle butteria. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Don't you have money? Uh, um. Well. So about that. Yes. This moose from Mooselandia, same like close to the same country, invaded my my country and stole all my chichingas and drove me here. You're expecting me to believe that a moose invaded your country? Yeah, and he stole my chicken, too. He stole your chicken. I don't care about your chicken. I just need rent money. Here, let me give you a dramatic flashback. Can you give me this dramatic flashback in the other room? Do I have to? Where I can sit down. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's go. Give me a hand. Give me a hand. Okay. This is a heavy pillow. Uh. Oh, what the? So, what are you doing? Waking you up? Waking me up. What do you think I was doing? You could have done it in a non-violent way. No, I couldn't. Oh, okay then. Well, um, what, what do you need to... Well, Hazard, I need the chair. You need the chair? Well, this chair is my bed. Hazard, come on, get up. Get right. oh, okay, okay. okay. All right, all right. What, I have to that? tell that the guy with the house. What's his name again? The ho this house owner. Yeah. I'm actually not sure what his name is. I we should we should find that out. That yeah. is very rude of us. I have to tell him about the story of Maldi the Moose. Moose. Why do you need to tell him that story? So I don't have to pay him. He found out that you're broke. Maybe. Ugh. So, uh, I told you this was going to happen. No, you didn't. Whatever, okay, I'll get the, I'll get the chair prepared. Bam. Alright, just go, go sit down. I'll... My pillow. My. So, I'll do it for you. I, I, I want pillow. So. Alright, it's prepared. So. I love doing that. Alright, now that I'm in my chair. Um, tell me the story of why you can't pay rent. So, would you care to explain to this fine gentleman why we can't pay the rent this month? Um, yes. So, we cannot pay the rent because we have no money. We have no money because our chachingas were stolen and my country was overtaken by Marty the Moose. Marty the Moose, an evil moose, took over our country. Stole all of our delicious pies. Because his pies tasted like dirt. Yes. My pies were very good because they were made by Chef Coco Waka. Chef Coco Waka? I made those pies, sir. I hate Chef Coco, Coco Waka. His pies were better. No, my pies were better. I am the king. I decide whose pies were better. Chef Coco Waka's pies were better, but your mac and cheese is better. Thank you, sir. So, what happened was Marty the Moose got word of our delicious pies and so he came and took some and he said oh my these are so delicious that he came into our country and overtook it he just took our country and we had to flee the country and um uh so like bread okay okay sir okay we'll make another music video some other time okay so what happened is he took over our country and we fled the country in our low-profile Studebaker, and we have not heard any word from him this far. But he could have tracked us. Yes, sir. Well, we don't know. So, wait, so, what is that? It's an emergency broadcast from the news. Oh, and it's made by Sally Sal Moo Moo. That's not her name. Am I reading that right? Sally no. Sal Moo Moo? I Maybe, actually, I don't know. Okay, let's watch. Hi, I'm Sally Salamumu, and I'm coming to you with a news flash. 
an auto repair shop has recently been blown up, like exploded. And all left in the rubble was a piece of paper that said, I'm coming for you, George, and I ate your baguette. So, one thing is, if your name is King George, then you are in trouble. End of news flash. Dab. Oh no, sir. The news said that Marty the Moose blew up our Studebaker. That's bad. Yeah, that's really bad. That means Marty the Moose is here I'm in this country. I'm not too there. You had your two. Oh my gosh, sir. That's the only thing you're worried about? Uh, and a big Marty baguette. Marty the Moose is coming. And it was a huge baguette. I don't care about your bread. I'll make you more bread. I, I'm a chef, if you don't know, if you didn't know. Yeah, you make me really good mac and cheese. Thank you, sir. But you make terrible steak. So, we already went over this. Burned it, and it's like food poisoning. Yes, we've gone over, yes, that was a whole episode. Sir, this is really bad. Marty the Moose is here I in know. this country. I'm gonna go set a base. Set a base? I wonder if I can find any Nerf guns. Nerf guns? Yeah. Are we going to fight off Marty the Moose? No. You're that, gonna build me a fort. I'm going to build you a fort. Yes. And you're going to fight off Marty the Moose. You're what a have, great like, plan. You know what? Small I, ones like the I'll I'll go look in that little boy's Pew! room. I think his name is Seamus. I'll go look in his room. Pew! Shut up! I thought his name was Carl. His name is not Carl, it's Seamus. I'll go look in his room, see if he has any nerf guns. Okay, let's go. Okay. Like bread. So this is a serious matter. Okay. Let's go. Bread. What? They just left. What? That was a dumb story. They expect me to believe that a moose from Moose-landia, a place I've never heard of, just conquered their country. How do I even know that they own a country? He could just be a psychopath. I'll give him another day to get the money. And then I'll kick him out. Yeah, that's what I'll do. Good good thinking. Good good thinking on me. I'm so smart. Yes I am. I'm gonna go play some Candy Crush. Okay, so I found some Nerf guns. We can protect ourselves with these. There you go. It's so small. What do you mean? It's small. Wait. They're, well, yes, they're handguns. Wait, hey, sorry. We have to make sure they work. Does this hurt? Ah, sir. Ah, got me right in my tummy. Okay, okay. Does this hurt? Don't. Oh, jukes for days. Sir, okay, whatever. Sir, did you hear that? There's someone at the door. Oh. Oh, could it be? <gasps> Boy Scout cookies. Hey, open the door. I'm selling Girl Scout cookies. Uh, so it sounds like Girl Scout cookies, but then again, it doesn't sound like a girl. Hey, sir. That's just me. What? Who are you to judge? Okay. Um, never mind then. I'm not going to answer the door. Okay, I'll answer the door. Okay. Okay. Ow! Sir, uh, seriously? Got you again, hey, Lord. <laughs> Bye. Alright, alright, alright. I'll answer Get the me door. the thin mints. Okay, so I'll answer the door. Uh, hello? <laughs> uh, Marty the Moose. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I am not a Girl Scout cookie. Uh, I'm coming for you, King George. Oh, no, it's Marty the Moose. Oh, it's jammed. Today, we are going to be doing some more training. What's this called? And why do I have a giant Nerf gun? This is called... Wrecking Noobs. Where did you get this? It's so cool. So big. Don't worry about that. Today, your task is to shoot that moose. Okay, okay first, you put up your aiming system. Put up your aim. Okay, now aim your gun. Okay, you look down the side and fire at will. Okay, the trigger. Bam! 
my shot. You did. You got him. <laughs> wow. Oh. Hmm. I did it. Yes. I'm no longer in pursuit of. Oh, I'm no longer. Watching the moose is no longer in pursuit of me. Ooh. I'm gonna go eat some pie. Oh. oh, that came out of nowhere. Well, okay, I'm gonna retreat. I'll be back for you, King George. Put a tracker down so I know where to go next time. Okay, I'll be back. <laughs>